Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak on 3.1.2 firmware. This will work on all devices, iPhone 3G, iPhone 3GS, iPhone 2G, iPod Touch 1st gen, 2nd gen, and 3rd gen. Now, the iPod Touch 3rd gen is tethered, so every time you turn it off, um, you'll have to re-jailbreak it again. So you may want to wait a little longer until they come out with the untethered. But if you don't turn it off that much or you just don't mind, go right ahead all the iPhone users if you rely on uh, ultra snow, yellow snow, whatever if you don't have a legitimate sim card in it and um, you're using like yellow snow or something um, don't do this because it will update your baseband and but if you're doing it legitimate legitimate um, and you pay for the iPhone service and everything um, then you can go ahead and do it I just want to show you real quick that I am on 3.1.2 firmware. Um, just go into my touch real quick. Um, you'll want this freshly restored and updated um, because it erases everything. So just go general about. And you can see that. Uh, 3.1.2 everything zero. So, there's that. And, so now it's really, really simple. Uh, don't even put it into DFU mode, just make sure it is connected. And, just go and go to the website in the description to download um, Black Rain. And, let me just show you real quick what it'll look like when you go. Black rain. There'll be a link in my description. Look like that. Just scroll down a little bit. And right here, just click on the window. That, and it'll download straight to your desktop. Just a simple exe file. All you have to do is double click. Um, one. Yeah. No. And it'll come up with this the simple make it rain button. All you have to do is you usually want to close out of iTunes, just a note. Just click make it rain. And just they'll say installing new drivers usually. And once this comes up you know it's working. Apple will pop up, just don't mind, I mean iTunes will, uh, just don't mind it, and then it will go, it'll be like that, and then it'll just be, like, updating and just restoring, pretty much, and it'll come up with this little message, jailbreak is done, um, once the iPhone reboots, uh, if this is simplest jailbreak ever. Please donate to blah 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 blah. If you paid anything for the software, demand a refund. Available from for free from BlackRain.com. Um, just say okay. And this will say done. Waiting for reboot. iTunes will come up with the little. We detected a five touch in restore mode. Don't mind it. Just don't exit out. But um. Just don't mind it. And there are a few more steps after it reboots, so I'll come back when it's done rebooting. Okay, now that it's done, um, you want to go to your second screen. Um, you need to add your Wi-Fi, just telling you, because it can't download without your Wi-Fi. Click on the black rain icon, and it'll come up with three things. Cydia, Rock, and Icy. Cydia is, every you probably know, IC is just a faster version of Cydia, supposedly. And Rock 
is a super fast version of Cydia, which backs up all your icons and your apps. So that's really cool. And you just have the green ones. You install anything. Make sure to install Cydia. You have to install that. Um, but Rock and IC are just options, so I'm just going to install it. And just click install that up at the top. And it's going to take a while, usually. It won't take too long, but um, it'll just be unpacking everything, downloading it. Um, and then once it's done, you can just go and if you see down here, it says uninstall black rain. You can just do that. Um, open it back up after all of it's done. And then your old thing will be jailbroken. And you can download everything you want from City or Rock or whatever. Um, so yeah, so thanks for watching and until my next video, just remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye guys.